Well, hey everybody, and welcome to another Grace Life Thursday update. It's an incredibly beautiful fall day outside today. Another great opportunity to remind ourselves that this is the day the Lord has made, and we will rejoice and be glad in it. Nothing really big to announce to you this, uh, this week other than to remind you, uh, please register early if you're going to attend either the 9.30 or 11 o'clock a.m. service on Sunday morning. We're preparing now for Thanksgiving. And by the way, there won't be an update next week, so this update will serve us for the next uh, couple of weeks. You know, people who have no religious background whatsoever, who aren't Christians and who have no concern about studying the Bible, have been telling us now for several years about the benefits of gratitude or cultivating a grateful spirit. It's interesting to watch how the world actually catches up with the scripture from time to time. You know, they tell us that gratitude has many, many benefits in your life, many health benefits. They tell us that cultivating a grateful spirit uh, can help you sleep better, uh, can help you not be depressed, uh, can help deal with, with hypertension issues in your life. They say that cultivating a spirit of gratitude will help you have more friends. I mean, who wants to hang around somebody who's complaining and grumbling, grumbling all the time? I know I don't. There are a lot of things that gratitude does for a person. Here are some other things. Helps you live longer, increases your energy level, helps your marriage, deepens friendships, increases your productivity. Well, this Sunday, we're gonna be looking at one simple verse in 1 Thessalonians 5, where the Apostle Paul tells us, in everything, give thanks. I heard somebody say the other day, something like this, you know, the year 2020 doesn't give us much to be thankful about. Well, I would disagree with that. I would say there are many things for us as Christ followers to be thankful about. And in every situation, it is possible for us to give thanks whether or not we may feel thankful. I hope you'll join me this Sunday, either at 9.30 or 11 o'clock, online or here in person with us as we think about what it means to grow up with gratitude. I'll be looking forward to seeing you this Sunday. God bless you, we love you. If there's anything you need, please let us know. Hey, this is a great time of the year to give thanks.